Hello everyone. In our today's video, I am going to talk about uh, the numerical which is based on chemical reaction equilibrium. In our last video, uh, we had uh, solved one numerical and today also we are going to solve one numerical problem. So the problem is a system initially containing two moles of C2H4 and three moles of oxygen and uh, undergoing the reaction. So the, these are the two reactions. The first reaction is C2H4 plus half O2 gives CH2 whole 2 O and C second equation is C2H4 plus 3 O2 gives 2 CO2 plus 2 H2. So this is your second reaction. Develop expression for, for mole fraction of reacting species as a function of reaction coordinates for two reactions. So in the previous uh, question uh, which we had solved in that uh, we need to develop expression for individual uh, reactions here we need to develop the combined uh, rea uh, expression for both the reaction okay so first what we do we just write down species so we have number of species c2h4 then oxygen then we have ch2 2o then we have uh, co2 which is not common right h2 so these are the different different species which we have now j here it denotes the uh, reactions okay so reaction one we have reaction one and reaction two and then we need to write down the stoichiometric coefficient of reaction uh, 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 stoichiometric coefficients of species in reaction one and uh, reaction two so in reaction one it is minus one c2h4 minus half or you can write 0 0.5 then this is positive so one these two are not present in the first reaction in the second reaction uh, c2h4 the stoichiometric coefficient is minus one uh, o2 minus three this is not there and this is my plus two and this is also plus two now we need to write down the overall stoichiometric coefficient for reaction one and reaction two so for reaction one 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 cancel so it is minus half or you can say minus 0.5 here plus 2 plus minus 4 so this is 0 okay and the total given total number of moles given total number of moles so which is n o and not it is 2 plus 2 initially 2 and 3 so total 2 plus 3 is 5 okay so now write down the expression for the first one so y c 2 h 4 okay gas phase so we know that the uh, formula we, we have formula is n i naught plus nu i epsilon upon n naught which is the overall total number of moles nu is overall uh, stoichiometric coefficient and epsilon is extent of reaction here we have two reactions so uh, we need to write Two extent of reactions for uh, this is for the epsilon one is for the extent of reaction for extent of reaction for reaction one and this is for the reaction two okay so now write down so we have initial number of moles of c2h4 is two then stoichiometric coefficient of uh, reaction one is minus one so minus epsilon one fine second uh, for the second one is uh, for the second reaction is also minus one so minus epsilon two divided by total number of moles are five so five plus for the first reaction it is minus 0 0.5 epsilon one then zero epsilon two so this will be equal to two minus epsilon one minus epsilon two divided by five minus 0 0.5 epsilon one so this is the uh, expression for C2H4, okay, mole fraction of C2H4. Now, for the second one, why O2? So, initial number of moles of uh, oxygen is 3. Fine, uh, stoichiometric coefficient is minus 0 0.5 epsilon 1. And for the second reaction, minus 3 epsilon 2. And denominator, we know that it remains same. So, it remains same, fine. Now, the third one is Y, CH2, 2O. So, in each, uh, 
stoichiometry total number uh, initial number of moles are there is no initial number of moles so zero plus stoichiometric coefficient is one so plus epsilon one and in the second reaction it is not there so zero epsilon two and denominator is remain same for everyone so this will be equal to epsilon one upon five minus zero point five epsilon one now next is why co2 so initial number of moles of co2 is zero and in the first reaction it is not there so epsilon one zero into epsilon one and for the second stoichiometric coefficient is two so two epsilon two divided by denominator is remain same so this will be equal to two epsilon two upon five minus zero point five epsilon one and for the last one h two o it is zero epsilon one plus two epsilon two five minus zero point five epsilon one so two epsilon two divided by five minus zero point five epsilon one so these are the five expressions. Uh, for mole fraction of reacting species as a function of reaction coordinate okay hopefully you will be able to understand this thank you